I'm Scott Cardell of the Palomar Observatory. I wanted to take a few minutes today and talk to you about something known as light pollution. Light pollution is an artificial brightening of the night sky. It can affect the work done by ground-based astronomers, but it also has an impact on wildlife, human health, and even contributes to global warming. One of the big sources of the problem of light pollution is the use of lights at night that are unshielded or lights that are improperly directed. I'm going to show you a very simple demonstration that shows off the tremendous importance of ensuring that outdoor lighting at night is properly shielded. Now we're going to do this demonstration with a very simple flashlight, mag light. I'm going to turn on the mag light and carefully remove the top. Now this acts as a unshielded street lamp, post lamp. You'll notice two things right away. First of all, there's a tremendous source of glare shining back at um, anyone looking at the light. Also, it brightens the night sky. Now, if I take a moment and actually put a pedestrian next to the light, you'll notice that this unshielded light, the pedestrian is standing in the shadow of the light. That's no good at all. So let me add some shielding to the light very simply. You'll notice that, wow, the glare is gone, the brightening of the sky is gone, and now it's actually possible to see the pedestrian. Very simple demonstration. This was first shown to me by Connie Walker of the National Optical Astronomy Observatory. She's also director of the Globe at Night Project, which actively monitors light pollution. So if you ever need to convince anyone of the importance of the shielding of outdoor lighting, I think this shows it off quite nicely. For more information about light pollution, you can visit the website of the Palomar Observatory or the International Dark Sky Association.